Let's explore how to draw angles in radius. So the question here is draw an angle of 5 pi by 3 and 5 pi by 6. Okay, so when we say draw an angle of this, we mean in standard position. Okay, so let's draw it in standard position. Let's say this is our coordinate plane. Okay, and the vertex has to be on the origin, right? That's the vertex position. And the initial arm will be along the x-axis, correct? Now let's figure out what is 5 pi by 3. So what do you understand by 5 pi by 3? So let's first see the angles on our coordinate plane. So if we make one full circle, that means we go through 2 pi radians, right? So, so you start from 0 and then finish with 2 pi radians, correct? So that is one full circle. Now half of this is pi radians, correct? So if we make half of the circle, it is pi. What do we need? We need 5 pi by 3. So if I could divide and get pi by 3, I can repeat those 3's 5 times and get 5 pi by 3. Pi by 3 means dividing this pi into 3 equal parts. Okay, so let's do it. So let's divide this pi which is from here to here into 3 equal parts. So let's say this one could be 1 and then 2 and this is 3. Okay, so that seems to be 3 equal parts for me. So let me join this and then draw lines. So this is 1. So I went closer, not exactly, doesn't matter. Even that was an approximation, so that's not bad either. So let me do one from here. So, okay. Fine. So we divided this pi into three equal parts. So each division, if you go in a circular way, anti-clockwise, anti-clockwise is, or counterclockwise is positive. Therefore, we go like this, one, two, three. Okay, so we got three pi by three, but we need five. That means we need to divide further. So this pi will give me three, and the other pi will give me three more. So I'll have six into pi. That makes, yeah, that's fine. So let's extend this, and And let's extend this one also. Now we have each division which is pi by 3. So 5 pi by 3 means what? 5 pi by 3 means let's start with the initial arm here. So that's our initial arm, right? And from here we go 1 pi by 3. 2 pi by 3, 3 pi by 3, 4 pi by 3, and 5 pi by 3. So that is our 5 pi by 3. Do you get it? That is how we should draw 5 pi by 3. And so we'll connect this, and that's our terminal arm. So this is the initial arm, that's the terminal arm, and this angle is 5 pi by 3. Correct? Now, the question is how to draw 5 pi by 6. Okay, so we already have a division, and each division for us was actually pi by 3. So let me write pi by 3 here for the time being. Okay, but what do we need now? We need pi by 6, that means half of this. So half of this, let's bisect this and then get pi by 6, right? So let's do that. And so these orange lines gives us pi by 6. So that is 1 pi by 6, 2 pi by 6, 3 pi by 6, okay? And then, well, if I bisect these, I get this as my orange line. Correct. And how about this? So I'll bisect from here. So I will get this as my orange Correct. 5 pi by 6. Let's count. So each is pi by 6 for me. So this is pi by 6, right? So 
1 pi by 6, 2 pi by 6, 3 pi by 6, 4 pi by 6 and 5 pi by 6. That's final. So this one is 5 pi by 6. Got it? So let's draw this. So here initial arm will overlap and the terminal arm will be here. So this will be our 5 pi by 6. Do you see that? So that is how easy it is to draw angles in radians. I hope now you understand how to draw angles in radians, right? So these videos I've shown one with multiples of pi by 4, the other one with multiples of pi by 3 and 6. So that should take care of most of the angles which you need to draw. Okay? And you can always bisect them to get further. For example, what is pi by 12? Pi by 12 will be here. Okay? Let me draw pi by 12 for you here. So easy, right? That one will be pi by 12. Correct? As an exercise, try drawing 5 pi by 12. And let me know in which quadrant will this fall. This is quadrant number 1. Let me remind you. That is quadrant number 2. This is quadrant number 3. And that one is quadrant number 4. 5 pi by 12. Half of 12 is 6. So 6 are here and 6 are there. So 5 pi by 12 should be in quadrant 1. Correct? That's the answer. Okay. Thank you.